Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we have got you a bonus video which is about Comic Inc. So the comic which you can see in the background is actually called Comic Inc. Okay, and the distance of that comet is hugely about 9.6000 kilometers. It is a very huge, uh, you know, comet and Today we are going to go deep into this topic and explore about more comet, uh, you know, about the uh, Eng's comet, the observations, you know, the discoveries made on it, who discovered it, who named it, and all things, okay? So let's start the video without wasting any time. Yes, so what are comets? Comet is an icy, small solar system body, okay? So it's just like planets and other creations, but it uh, they are small. They cannot be classified as planets. Uh, so these comets, uh, when they pass, you know, when uh, close to the sun, they heat up and they start to begin, uh, you know, release uh, gases from them. Okay, that is what uh, you know differs it from asteroids and meteors. That's why they are called comets. Okay, so this was about what is an comet. Yes, so Comet Eng or Eng's Comet is a periodic comet which completes its rotation around the uh, around Sun every 3.3 years. Okay, so Eng Comet was first recorded or discovered by Peary McCain on 17 January 1786. Okay, uh, but it was not officially declared uh, as a periodic comet until 1818. That was because of the technology. It was not so de developed. But in 1819, when uh, its orbit was, you know, calculated by uh, Johann Franz Eng, okay, so it was not, uh, after that, they started to give it a, uh, an importance, you know, after he calculated the uh, uh, the orbit of that uh, Eng, uh, of the Eng's comet. But like other, uh, well, uh, like Halley's comet, it is still an unusual thing that it is being named by uh you know the calculator of its orbit rather than its discoverer okay just like it had to be named by Peary McCain but no it was named after Johann Franz Eng just like Halley's comets uh uh you know uh the calculator uh of its uh orbit okay so this was about the introduction yes so the discovery of the Eng's comet. So the Eng's comet was first, uh, you know, discovered uh, after uh, the Halley's comet. Okay, so it was uh, the first periodic comet discovered, but after the Halley's comet. Okay, it was independently observed by several astronomers. The first two being Peary McCain and Charles uh, Messier in 1786. Then it was discovered for a third time by Jean Luce Pons in 1818, and after that it was cal calculated by Johann Franz Eng, and many more astronomers, you know, had uh, discovered this uh, uh, Eng's comet. And in 1819, it was recovered or discovered by rediscovered by Carl Ludwig Christian Rundke, okay, Rundke, on 2nd June. So this uh, is really, uh, this comet has a very long discovery list behind it because many, many, many astronomers had discovered this, uh, uh, you know, uh, comet and named it, okay? So this was about the discovery. Yes, so the orbit of this comet. So as you can see behind in the picture, it shows uh, that uh, this comet, uh, it comes between Mercury's and Earth's orbit. So first it passes Mercury and then through Earth and it goes. So that's what is uh, its, you know, uh, comet's area, the orbit of the comet. And this Eng's orbit gets about 0 0.173 AU close to Earth. So whoever does not know about AU, you can go check out my video about AU uh, that is called as Astronomical Unit. Uh, so I'll send the link in the uh, description box. 
So on 4th July 1997, uh, Inc. had passed through Earth about 0.19 AU. Okay, that's very, very near to Earth. And after that, on, on June 29, 2172, meaning the year uh, 2172, uh, uh, it will pass again. But it will pass uh, with a very, very close approach, meaning it will come very close to uh, the Earth. And, uh, you know, as I told you before that uh, the Halley's Comet comes near Earth every 3.3 years. In every 3.3 years, it comes to Earth. Last time it was recorded on 2017, it came near Earth. And the next will be after 3.3 years, okay? So this was about the orbit of the comet. Yes, so what was the observations made on this comet? So this comet has been observed ev at every perihelion, okay? Perihelion means uh, the time when Earth and that comet comes close together, okay? Uh, since 1818, as I told you, when the uh, technology had been, you know, uh, surpassed when it had been developed. And uh, like every astronomer wants to uh, capture the photo of that comet in the cameras, but they could not. They had tried this on 2nd July 1913, but they could, uh, 1913, but they could not uh, do it, okay? Because the telescope was not so developed to catch a perfect photo of that comet. Again, it had been, uh, you know, uh, tried upon, uh, uh, on uh, 1st September, 1913 and again we could not get the uh, you know perfect result because we could see a thing which is you know uh, traveling through space but we could not get to know that is it the Halley's or uh, the Engs comet or something else okay so this was about the observations made on it thank you everyone I hope you like this video Please like, share and subscribe my channel. And I want to also say one thing that I have another channel called as Indian Animal Explorers. I'll give the link in the description box. Please click that link and subscribe the channel too. You'll be getting fresh videos on animals and other details on their habitats. Thank you. Bye-bye.